Justin, I, I, I contacted you and I was like, hey man, let's do a good recipe. And I was like, let's do one that's Christmas based. Mm -hmm. And this is Christmas in Texas. Absolutely. So show us what you got here. Well, when you're all turkeyed out and hammed out, you go, you go beef. We're in Texas, right? Mm -hmm. So this is a, a recipe that my family does. We do every year for uh, Christmas. It's uh, beef ribs. It's what you're looking for, what I'm looking for when I go for these is I'm just looking for as much thickness that I can for the meat. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna show you how to, how to peel this silver skin off and trim some of that hard fat down that's not gonna render when you cook it. This silver skin is not good to eat. So you wanna get that off. We've gotten our silver skin off. We're gonna start working on this really hard fat right here. This okay. is fat you're not gonna to get to render out no matter how long you cook it because it's super hard. You wanna be careful, you know, just take your time. There's no hurry. Mm -hmm. The last thing you wanna do is run that knife down into the meat, but look, look at that big old hunk of fat. That will never render. So I'm gonna say that's good, man. I think, Perfect. We're, I think yeah. we're ready. Okay. We do, on a beef rib, we do leave the 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 uh, membrane on on the bottom because this meat's gonna pull so much. That's, that's kind of how we're gonna keep it attached to those big old yeah. bunches. I see some Cosmo products here, which is always, good thing to see whenever I Absolutely. see anything going on with the grill. So what, what is your, uh, what, what do you use here? We've got a Cosmos Reserve Blend Injection. We're gonna pump these suckers up. What I try to do is go right on top of the meat and just push a little at a time. It ain't gonna take much. So we're gonna go with Dirty Bird Hot and give a little bit of that spice. We're gonna go with the Texas Beef. It's got a little bit of sugar in it, so it's gonna kind of caramelize and crust up and make us an awesome crust. And then also, regular old black pepper. We're gonna let that set probably 30 minutes to an hour before we throw it on the smoker. How long do you usually go with these? So we're, we're gonna cook these on the drum. We're gonna run it pretty hot, right out 300 degrees. So we're probably gonna do this five and a half hours. Do you have a certain temperature you shoot for? Uh, I consider this brisket on a stick. If I had to guess, and it's gonna be in the 205 to 210 range. Here we go. Wow, good flavor. 